Hello, my name is Eric White, and we're going to talk about how to set your Windows XP up for widescreen LCD. So let me guess, you went down to the electronics store and you bought that widescreen display and you can't wait to get it home. So here you are, you're sitting at your desk, you're all ready to go. So you plug the widescreen LCD in. And what's going to happen is Windows XP is going to install a driver by default uh, for default monitor. And then it's just going to load your, your screen right up. Uh, it may try and set it to a smaller than native uh, display resolution. Uh, usually when it tries to do that, it'll complain and say, would you like us to fix it? Go ahead, let it fix it. If that still doesn't happen, you can go in and you can manually, manually fix it. Now, the driver knows the dimensions of your, of your LCD. So when you go to look at the options, you're going to see uh, resolution options for your LCD. So in the middle of your desktop, just right click and then left click on properties. That's going to bring up your display properties box. Go to settings. And notice I have mine turned all the way up. This is a 21 inch widescreen monitor, 1680 by 1050. Now you can scroll back through and change these, but what you're going to want to do, and I know that you did your research on your, on your display before you bought it, so you know what the native resolution is. If not, go look up in your user guide. Find out what the, the best resolution is for your monitor, and then set it right here. Once you get that done, your computer's set up and XP running in widescreen mode on your LCD.